Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time tuning in and then hey girl, how you doing? I'm Claudia and I do videos on beauty, fashion and majority lifestyle vlogs. So if you're into any of that, then you're definitely at the right place. I hope you do stay, you subscribe and you become a part of the family. And if you're returning a sabi honey, then thank you so much for stopping back. Bye. So in today's video, as you can tell by the title, I bring to you a big shopping haul. So if you've watched my previous vlog, you would already know about this haul and you would be expecting it at this point um, because in that vlog it's uh, in that vlog is when I went out for majority of the shopping stuff as well as where I received majority of the online orders and where I placed some orders online so yeah I have a huge uh, I have a big shopping haul and I'm super excited to be showing you guys what I got my room my beauty room is in a total mess um, I shall show you what it looks like so this is what I am dealing with. I have furniture from DecoFriend that needs assembling, that needs to be uh, decorated. I need to show you guys all that. This is some of it also. And then I have some orders from Take A Lot that needs unboxing. I have clothing from Mr. Price that needs a haul. Um, and then also more unboxing. And then majority of the stuff is just shopping. Um, this there's a few stuff in here as well and then I purchased some trees as well some plants as well so yeah that is what I have going on and that's what my beauty room looks like at this moment and now that you've seen what it looks like I don't want to waste further of your time let's get straight into this I have my bottle of water hmm. I have some snacks because this is gonna be a long one <laughs> So I want to keep the same energy that I have from the beginning throughout the entire vlog, hopefully that will be possible because <sighs> I've been losing energy. It's just not working. But anyways, let me not waste further of your time and let's get into this video. Okay, so before we get into the video, I actually want to take you guys a little bit this way. So before we get into the video, I just want to put this out there. I don't know if there's anybody who feels this way, but I still want to put it out there. I hope that you guys... Don't take this shopping vlogs or videos some type of way like I'm trying to show off or whatsoever because I'm not. I just have a the love. I just have the love for shopping. I enjoy shopping so much. It's just one of those favorite hobbies. I could literally do shopping for a living if 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 that was going to pay me. But I am mostly spending money on it. So um, I hope you guys don't take it as a as in a way that she's trying to show off or whatsoever because I'm honestly not. I love shopping i just enjoy shopping so much it just brings me so much joy either it be shopping for home deco um clothing or whatsoever i just enjoy i don't want to say spend money but i enjoy getting stuff that i actually want and i am so fortunate and i'm grateful i mean i'm so grateful that in majority in most cases i can actually get the stuff that i want because I try to save up as po as much as possible, even though sometimes I go overboard. But I try to save up for majority of the stuff before actually buying it. Let's just wait for this car to pass. So yeah, I hope that is cleared and that you guys enjoy shopping hauls. Otherwise, if you don't, then I'm going to stop putting out these kind of videos. Um, because I don't want to... You know, I don't want to make people feel some type of way about my own money. <laughs> so yeah, now that we have that out of the way, let's get into this shopping vlog. I will not be able to show you guys majority of the stuff because they are quite heavy. I don't want to hurt myself. As you've noticed that majority of my shopping vlogs are actually home deco. Because I'm somebody who loves, loves a beautiful, I just love a beautiful, cozy, homely home. Um, I love turning a house into a home, even though it may be a rental. I love being in a comfortable place where I feel at home, um, that feels welcoming to people that come, that feels welcoming to anybody, and that I can actually, when I'm out and I'm super exhausted or we come back from um, a, a holiday or vacation or a getaway, we can actually say, no, we're going home, and it's going to be relaxing, you know? I love a beautiful home. I don't care how big it is or how small it is, as long as it's comfortable and it's beautiful and we achieve that beauty on a budget then I am here for it. So I've been shopping quite a lot of home deco stuff because I'm trying to turn this house into a home. I want to make it as comfortable as possible and before the new baby comes I want to be cozy. I want to be you know I want to feel homely. I want to feel at home. I don't know if you guys get me but I just want a comfortable house 
and I'm restless if the house is not comfortable even though I'm one of those people once more Aquarius people who tend to change up things oftenly um, I can't like I, I get anxious when something is the same like for months and months it's the same curtains hanging there i can't i can't i get i get i get anxious i get irritated and i just want to change up stuff so i know i'm going to be changing up stuff as time goes but as long as i have that one time where it's homely and where it's comfortable and just cozy i'm good so I'm, I'm, I'm rambling now, I'm rambling a lot and this is one of the reasons why I decided to do this video separately. I'm busy with my beauty room as you all know and I'm sure you might be thinking, wow, are you still busy with that? When are you going to finish? Here's the thing when it comes to home decoing and that I'm also just realizing is that it takes a lot of time. It takes a lot of time, patience and a lot of money to get it together and get it the way that you want it and sometimes it also just don't turn out the way that you envisioned it to be like. So um home deco so with home deco and um furniture buying especially when it's big furniture that you're getting it takes a lot of patience it takes a lot of money that you need to save up you can't just be buying unless you are rich like that then you can actually buy as much as you want or buy everything at the same time but for me as for me i need to save up if i want to buy a furniture piece like a big furniture piece for the smaller stuff i can actually just go out and um take my allowance and then uh, buy stuff like that like baskets and stuff like that but when it comes to furniture pieces i need to save up and me being somebody that loves shopping I'm constantly online screenshotting stuff um, from stores, taking pictures of stuff, writing them down in books and just budgeting, okay, for this month to this month, this is how much I'll be able to save up and actually purchase some stuff. Okay, so I'm busy with my beauty room, like I mentioned, and finally I am starting to feel like it will actually come together. So I purchased this table, it's a white desk actually, off of Decofren. I'm gonna insert pictures of other things and or videos or whatever of the items as it's still in boxes and it needs assembling and that will be in a separate video obviously. It's in a white uh, color and it has like, not a drawer per se, but space where you can actually keep some stuff or stump stationery this is going to be my study desk i am so happy that i finally got a study desk and i can finally leave my dining room table alone i've been sitting there editing my videos studying eating i, I basically do holds there everything i i just use my dining table for everything and i feel like that's just not the way it's, it's supposed to be i want to have my space for studying which would give motivate me even more i want it to be refreshing and to be you know where i will not be distracted because in my dining room i can actually just sit there and watch tv and i get distracted from my studies and stuff like that so yeah i got myself a study desk i've been saving up i've honestly been searching everywhere i went to game i went to the china shops i went everywhere to find um it started desk. however i got it from decofin so you guys might be wondering some of you don't know decofin decofin uh a decofin sa is a furniture store in south africa they have on uh, an online store and they have walk-in stores i think in Gauteng and in the cape town um area i know about the one in cape town this is not my first time buying from decofin this is actually my second if not third time and they are super affordable i feel like they are super affordable than any uh, store that i've seen or that I've been to furniture store here in our area or in any other area. They are super affordable um, and their quality, I feel like it's just perfect for the price that you pay for. So mid last year, my, I did my first purchase off of Decofren and they gave me an estimated time. However, the things came really, really quick and I love that I only paid 350 rands for everything for like one delivery and it was like a big truck. Um, and you can also have them assemble your stuff, like pay extra 25 rands or 50 rands for them to come and assemble your items. So yeah, you can check them out. They have an Instagram page. They always have like discounts, 10% sales. Oh, um, I, I always run those ones i always eat for those ones i'm always there waiting for those 10 percent and 25 percent discount codes but yeah i purchased the headboard i bought i purchased my uh two pedestals for my bedroom and um, i also got my tv plasma or tv unit from deco friend which i love by the way so i love the color i love it i just love the size of it and the, for the price I feel like it's a steal and I also purchased a book my bookshelf um, which is more or less the same shade the same color and same hood they used for the 
TV unit. They have super affordable coffee tables. I've been looking for coffee tables and I've been wanting to buy from their girlfriend. I'm just a little bit worried about the sizes of the coffee table. I don't want a really, really flat coffee table where my baby can get on top, <laughs> you know. But um, I was willing to purchase from their girlfriend. But in the previous vlog, you would know that I bought from... Um, Mr. Price home while well, I, I placed my order because they were out of stock in our store as well as online But anyways, that's gonna be another video for another time when I do the living room But yeah, that's the four items I bought the first time from deco friend and this time around I bought my study desk and then I got myself an ottoman like a fur ottoman Which is gonna look cute. I'm super excited you guys. You don't know how happy I am I got myself another bookshelf, the exact same one that I purchased for my living room, but I just got this one in white for my beauty room because I'll need some storage as well and to use it like in a bag, in my backdrop or something for decoration. And then I got myself a lamp floor or a floor lamp rather for my study area so I can have light there. I don't need to switch on the lights for the entire room and just to have light there when I maybe study, wake up at four o'clock, which has been happening oftenly <laughs> four o'clock and i are like this now but anyways that's what i got from deco for an sm i also got my baby this beautiful dog ottoman he loves loves it and i had to unwrap it because the moment i saw it i was like he's gonna love it i just need to open it up and he has been enjoying playing with it so much so yeah those are the stuff from a deco friend um i'm only gonna be able to pick up this one which is the uh, fur ottoman um, yeah, and I also love that they have the names and everything on the um, actual packages so you know what's inside. So this needs assembling. My husband and I are going to do that. That's going to be a separate video. I'll be assembling it. I'll try and keep it uh, uh, as one, like edit all the bits and pieces as one because I know I'm not going to do everything at the same time. So once I assemble it and once I go about decorating it, I'll edit all those videos together, those clips, and give you all one vlog. Now let's move on to take a lot. So... We ordered from Take A Lot, well, I ordered from Take A Lot. Most, majority of the stuff, huh, all of the stuff is my my purchases because, firstly, I had my monthly allowance. And if you watched my Q&A, um, you would know that I mentioned my husband injured himself. So I've been taking care of him and both my baby, which I don't mind because it's my family. But my husband was like, you are such a good wife, such a good mommy. Um, so let's double up on the monthly allowance. I was like... <laughs> Do it, baby. Do it now. Do it. I will, I will not say no. So he doubled up on my monthly allowance. And then I also got like an extra, you know, on the side. He was like, buy yourself something. And obviously, or buy yourself um, the furniture. He was like, buy yourself the stuff that you want to get. The decoration stuff for your beauty room so you can get it over and done with and stop stressing about it. So I had quite enough. Oh, I had enough money to get a lot of stuff um some stuff you don't know about so i know it's gonna be a shock for for him to see the purchases that i did um and that's why i covered up in a sense so i'm gonna show you guys what i got him as well but let's move on to take a lot so i did the take a lot order this was for both of us um these two he already opened um so i have two big boxes two, oh, let me just pick this up so these are the boxes from take a lot oh <laughs> the first these two are already open because my husband can't wait this is actually his i don't know what this is this is a high speed premium hd hdmi cable okay so this is his um in here i don't know why this is so big for just two memory cards in here i got ourselves two sendix um extreme pro memory cards it's 128 gigabytes so i need one for my for my camera obviously and then one for him that's just how it looks like okay those are the two things let's open up this one okay you guys so i was gonna use the table to open i was gonna use the table to open this up but the light sunlight is coming through and it's making everything appear dark Okay, so oops, this box is breaking. So in this box, okay, so I've been struggling to get this light to adjust. Do you see that? 
it's too much exposure in this room so i think i definitely have to change up the curtains but anyways this is the first box this is the first box from take a lot and what i got was this i want to show you guys from the table but i can't even move this camera i don't want to risk it i got this bamboo laptop table i'm going to insert a picture of it because i'm opening it up now i think i need to assemble it as well so yeah it's the bamboo it's the fine living brand bamboo laptop table um i feel like i needed this both my husband and i need this especially with winter approaching um our majority of the time be in bed and him as well so this would just come handy to have the laptop on i've been wanting a laptop tray i saw one from pep home but the other time when i went back they were sold out it was not bamboo it was more like plastic um and it went for 100 rand so you guys can check out pep home if you maybe want like a laptop uh, not a tray per se but a laptop is it a stand laptop stand yes um the one that you can actually put on your lap or whatsoever now the light is a little bit too bright but anyways we're going to continue okay this um is what is this that i got then the next thing i got is the escape mini uh tabletop tripod as you all know i don't have a type i don't have a tripod to carry my camera around and that's why i don't go out when i do go to stores i don't use my camera to vlog i use my phone instead because i'm so scared of dropping it i'm the most clumsiest person ever so yeah i finally decided to get myself one um a tripod a mini tripod and this is how it looks like and it also comes with this um where you clip the phone on or where you can clip the phone on or where you can have the camera also so yeah i got this as well i'll put the price on the screen for this two stuff or th all the stuff that i got from take a lot um i'll enter the prices on the screen and then i'm gonna open the other box and this is the second box that I got. Okay, so the second thing that I got is this also from Find the Living Brand. It's a bamboo breakfast tray. This is how the box looks like. Okay, so the main reason I decided to get this is because my husband is in bed. He's on sick leave or bed rest. Obviously, also be using this, especially during winter times. I love <laughs> being in bed during winter times. I'm not a winter type of girl. I hate the cold. So I will be in bed majority of the time. So, so those are the recent purchases off of Take A Lot. I do have a few other stuff that I bought from Take A Lot a while back. If you guys remember when I did my organize my beauty room type of video with me, um, I had a box in a corner and I was like this, I still need to do like an unboxing with you all. And I was planning on doing that, but I never get to it. So I'm thinking, let me just throw that in here as well. Um, so I can get it over and done with. It doesn't need to be in the boxes anymore. I can start using them. Um, I actually need my app to see all the stuff that I got. And so the first thing I got is the Tech Geek. Okay, no. The first thing that I got was the Sunbeam Garment Steamer. Um, I don't have it up here. It's in my kitchen. I purchased that steamer. It was 250 rands. Um, I mainly purchased it for uh, when I do clothing hauls and majority of the times you know that clothing do come wrinkled or when they are packaged, how they are packaged and transported. So I got the garment steamer for when I don't need to iron stuff and if I want things to look neat, I can basically just have them on the hanger and steam them. I got the garment steamer and then I got my husband a um, world map full desk coverage gaming and office mouse pad. That was 150 rands. Then I got myself the Tech Geeks desktop. It's a 10 inch, um, a 10 inch LED ring light and stand. So it was the Tech Geeks desktop, 10 inch LED ring light and stand for live streaming. That's how the box looks like. 
then this is the actual ring light so it is for a desktop um, the light it also has its switches over here so it has the switches this is the type of cord it comes and it also has this um, phone holder thingy over here so yeah this I would not like to use not stable at all however I do use it still it's like really really flat like it, it slips even though it has this grips on the um, legs or whatever you call this but it doesn't grip on it like it slips it slips so much that it's actually flat flat and you can't have it like standing up like this unless you place it into something like a glass holder then you can have it like that so it is a really not stable the legs are not stable at all however it was really affordable it was 195 rand the first ring light i purchased for myself was this 12 inch ring light and it comes with this um with the stand or do they call this a tripod i paid like 700 and something rand 700 rands plus the korea fee which was 150 rand so it was quite expensive and i only after purchasing this one i found out that take a lot also sells this well i knew take a lot sells it but i didn't know it was this affordable okay and then the second ring light i got i decided to get enough ring lights especially when i'll be filming at night um however this one i haven't opened yet so this is the 10 inch ring light with the two meter tripod and this one was 223 rands This is the um, ring light itself. I haven't used this yet, like I mentioned. As you can see, it's the cords are still uh, tied up. This is how it comes. It's like that, the ring light, and then once more where you place the phone on top, or I think you can also put your camera on here. And then this one came with an actual adjustable tripod that I also actually totally forgot about. I forgot about this tripod completely. But yeah, this is the tripod. It's a two meter um, tripod, adjustable tripod with the ring light and it was 223 rands. 223 rands or I think cheaper, but that's the actual price that it's showing right now. So yeah, this was what I got. Let me just close this. Okay, so those are the ring lights that I got from Take A Lot. And then I also got myself the Boya by MM1 Cardioid Condenser Microphone. And that's what I'm using right now. But I'll insert the picture of it. It came in this bag that just says Boya on top. And it also... So we had the microphone in here. And then the other thingy, I don't know what you call that piece where you clip it on. I'm going to show you guys where you put it on the microphone and then you can have it on the camera and then also just a little cord um, again and this one was 498 rands but I think I paid 300 and something at that point um, so yeah then my husband purchased uh, for, for the both of us this Polaroid True Wireless Stereo Earbuds this ones are mine and he's he already started using this ones went for 328 rands and like i mentioned mine is still closed i'm just gonna get the scissors to show you all how it looks like open it up like that and there you have it in its case and this is how long the earbuds are this is also the charger um, so you plug it in, you plug it in here to charge it. And once more, this went for 328 rands each. Then I lastly got this Preggy Belly Band by Carrie Well. I had this, a similar band, a previous pregnancy. It helped a lot, especially when I had like tops that were, you know, uh, shorter or getting smaller. My belly was showing out underneath. I would wear this. So 
for me it doesn't give a lot of support but it does help with when you have like tops or vests that are just a little bit shorter and you don't want to buy a lot of maternity stuff honestly so um i would wear this and it would just cover up underneath there it helps when you wear jeans and um whatever just and it has a little bit of support so i got this uh, one but this purchase was with another purchase i got this one and this one went for 179 rands i also haven't used it yet i'm about to use it today <laughs> so yeah those are the things that i got from take a lot now we're done with take a lot now that we're done with take a lot what more unboxing do we have i actually want to go into my husband's purchase because it is a surprise for him for being um the greatest husband and also just to come in already to relax him before the big reveal the big shock of the purchase that i made i'm gonna do his unboxing last so let's move on to the shopping so these are done oh no okay so this is another package that i got for myself and uh delivery that came i think this is the last one last online delivery or order and this is actually from switch beauty i placed this order on the 8th of april that's when they had the big sale their birthday sale i think they were six years they took six years i'm not sure I'm, i i might be mistaken but um i know it was their birthday sale i got myself two um facial sprays okay so i got the superhero spray um it's a glass skin mist and i also got the superhero spray the dewy skin mist they are both 125 mils and they had the sale on their website because it was their birthday sale and everything on the website was actually 100 rand 100 rands so i was wanting i always wanted to get one of the sprays i always wanted to get one of the sprays but i didn't know which one to start with or which one to actually get because they both seems like they seemed like they did wonders um so when i saw this sale the first thing in the morning what i did was went online and i started shopping and i got them both 200 rands paid for both uh, plus my delivery i think was 75 rands it took a little while to get to me because they with all the incoming orders because of the birthday sale obviously um they had like a lot of orders to sort out and to send out and stuff like that so i got this too my baby always wants to be in the video somewhere his voice must just be heard to give me that glass finished skin a dewy skin during this winter times i'm super excited to be trying out this too okay so moving on to the shopping that i went out and did so i'm gonna start random so from game i got this basket you guys um and i got it's for storage actually um so i have this big gem basket or storage holder that I got for my baby's toys. This is gonna be another video that I'll be sharing with you guys. So my baby needs a playing area. He has his bedroom upstairs, but he doesn't, he barely plays there because we're majority of the time downstairs, or I'm majority of the time downstairs, um, but I'm mostly gonna be upstairs. I'm gonna be upstairs once I get my beauty room together so i decided to get some storages because his toys are all over the living room um you trip on it you basically have to bend down and pick up a lot of stuff and i'm so over it so this idea where that's coming up i think that's going to be pretty soon because i placed an order from take a lot once more i've been buying from take a lot a lot <laughs> Take a lot a lot. Take a lot. I hope you see me. I've been buying from your store a lot. <laughs> Got this from a game. It's the big gem alpha storage box and it's clear um, as you all can see then i got this basket i do have this one my baby keeps knocking jaya go away from here i'm busy what do you want what do you want baby you want to come in no what do you want <laughs> You wanna come in? Okay, so I have my visitor again, like always. And this one is in silver. This one is quite small. I'm um, not small, but this is um what is the size? This is the medium. So this is a medium size basket. Um I initially wanted ones that are brown. I do have one. I'm gonna show you guys that one if I don't forget. I wanted those ones i was initially on the hunt for those however i couldn't find them in store they were sold out so i got four of this ones um i'm gonna put the price on the screen if i can find it and then i got this ones which are much more bigger than this ones as you can see 
first hand basket and this is in a large um so and it's also in the color white so i got gray and white so i got four of this ones as well then i also got this big black dustbin for my kitchen i wanted one with a lid i've been wanting a dustbin with the lid you know when there's always flies around the kitchen you don't know where it's coming from or where it's going to it's to the dustbin that's open so i needed one that has a lid because i don't have i've been using the one without a lid um so yeah this is the black one that i got inside i placed some stuff my mom said i should get some hangers so i got some um i got myself some stationary stuff for my studying so i just got some pants and i got a pencil case i got a packet of pony filler for all the holes and stuff that we'll be making i also got this four pack cleaning set wow. this is for the car um so yeah this is just how it looks like i got a ruler then i got this microwave cover as well because i realized i don't actually own one the gray um rattan baskets were 60 rand and the bigger ones was 120 rands so yeah those are the things that i got from game let's move on to the plastic wear store okay so from the plastic wear store i got two big pot plants or plant pots pot plants i think two big ones and i spray painted those ones um and i also got two medium sized ones so the big ones are right there in my doorway in the hallway i'm sure you guys won't be able to see that far because it's super dark in that corner and then i also went ahead and i purchased this um plastic little containers crayons and whatever small cars or whatever we i can store in here like enough storage would just be better than no storage at all so i bought this i think i bought four or yeah i think i bought four the other two he played with or five i'm not sure so i got this ones they went for five rents 30 cents each then i also because that that's the first place i went to before i went to game i also went for this big jam um containers and storage containers and these ones were 40 rand so this would also work really perfectly for his smaller cars his building blocks and um some puzzles or whatever i can find to put in here because he has a lot of toys that's just lying around and yeah, I got 40, this one for one went for 40 rands, 90 cents, and I got two of these containers. I also decided to get like a tray. I also got this scrubbing brush. I think I'm going to start using a brush to scrub my pots instead of a, of the steel thingy. Instead of the steel what what, because I feel like they ruined the pot so much. So I got this brush, was 22 rands, 50 cents. I also just got some bandages. I went to Crazy Store, the Crazy Store. I bought a TV mount, a guitar for my baby, because I know he loves dinosaurs so much. Then I saw this letter board that I've been wanting to purchase from Shein. When I saw this, I was like, I'm getting it. It was 139 rands, 90 cents. Um, I just opened to see how it looks like on the inside, but I haven't used it yet. So that's how it looks like. And on the inside, it has the stand. Um, it has the letters and the numbers. There's like two sets of it. And then it has the board where you can... Oh, let me just take this up. So it has the board like that and you can just slide the numbers on and then have it standing this is gonna look so cute on my study desk okay now moving on to pep home i did quite some buying from pep home um majority of the stuff um i would say is half for the beauty room half for the living room because i'm gonna decorate uh each area as time goes well, the first things that i got are throws so um i don't own couch covers and i'm wanting i've been wanting to buy some but i've never found any that's really affordable and i have an l couch with a single couch um like an, a single with a single chair as well like a single couch um and i'm gonna be buying from she and i found them on she and really affordable i decided to get throws for the time being because my couch looks horrible it gets stained really really easily I'm really hoping to be able to change up the 
um, color of the cow. This one I got from Pep Home. I opened one so I can measure it. Um, it is a little bit short for the couch for the L shape. However, I'm gonna get one more so I can like my mom can like sew it in and make it look like one big one. Um, and then, or oh, I don't know, cut, cut it in half. So one half in and use the other half for the single chair. I'm not sure how what I'm gonna be doing, but I decided to go for this shade. Um, which has more like a black in it and a little bit of brown. My couch kind of have like a mixture of that shade. However, this is more darker and my couch is mu much more lighter. Yeah. I got couch covers or rather throws for the couch. And this one went for, I got two of them and they went for $129.99. And this is 120 by 170 centimeters. Acrylic mingle throw. So yeah. That's how it looks like. That's the size for me as well. So if you're maybe interested, and they had different colors, but I actually decided to go for this one. I also decided to get scatter cushion covers, um, something a little bit different that kind of matches, you know, this, or that would go well with this. I'm not sure how it would look like, but this is like velvety. For some reason, Pebble doesn't have beautiful, um, cushion covers no more like they used to because I used to buy quite a lot of covers and they were super affordable but anyways these covers went for $34, $34.99 each this is the shade that I got it is um doesn't say the name no it doesn't say the the shade name but it is like a um champagne it's ivory shade beautiful velvet shade so I got three I got six Six um, sketch cushion covers, which I feel like is a little bit, which I feel like is a little bit too much, but I can change them up once the one set gets dirty. So yeah, and then for my beauty room, I got this clock. It's black and it has marble on the inside, and this one went for, and this went for sixty rands. So I also decided to get this frame, uh, this photo frame. It's thirty four ninety nine rands. This is how beautiful it looks like. It also goes matches beautifully in this beauty room. I also do like the message on the inside that says uh, "Enjoy the little things." This is super cute. However, I think I'm gonna place a photo of my family. I got two plastic spray bottles for my hair, so I'm gonna mix one with maybe leave-in conditioner or whatever, and the other one just plain water so when i saw this i was so so happy these are actually cutlery holders um so you can keep like your spoons or whatever in the kitchen i'm gonna get some more for the kitchen however these ones are actually for the beauty room to keep my makeup brushes or whatsoever and sponges over here so this went for 34.99 each they are silver um i might end up spray painting them to gold i'm not sure just keeping it silver i will see but yeah I got this too. Another thing that I got was this beautiful mug. It, it says "Live Happy," and it went for fourteen rands ninety nine cents. It's in this beautiful green color. I just love, love this mug. It's so cute. I love mugs. If you know me, you know I'm constantly buying mugs. And last year winter, I went overboard with purchasing mugs everywhere that I went. If I saw a mug that was really nice. Even if it means getting one for myself, I will get it. I have some more glassware over here from Tab. I got the exact same mug as the previous one, but just in a mustard color. So I got one for myself and one for my mans. This is just so cute. My husband really got my genuine from my glass also. And then you guys, I got this beautiful tall mug as well. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. And it looks like a chocolate kind of shade. And this one went for 19 rands 99. If you're a tea lover or coffee lover, follow me on my Instagram. You will always see stories where I do like good morning stories with beautiful mugs and stuff like that. I just love mugs. I love beautiful mugs. My tea tastes differently from a beautiful mug. Then I got a salad bowl. This is a glass bowl. I'm gonna use this for salad because I have one, but it's smaller. So I thought, let me get a bigger one when I saw this. And this went for 32 rands 99 cents. Um, I love the detailing on the app. And of course, who am I if I don't get plates? <laughs> I got this beautiful plate, you guys. I got two of them. Oh my word, these are so stunning. Look at that. Oh my God, look at that. This is so beautiful and aesthetically pleasing and they went for 17 rands 99. 
each so i only got two and i got two more dinner plates and this is how they look like i kind of have similar plates to this one but just in like a green shade this is like white beige with um i don't know what color that's coming through but yeah and it's like an irregular shape it's not a complete circle as you can see it has like curves and stuff like that and this went for 26 and 99 each so i only got two did i mention these are actually just side plates and then the bigger ones are obviously dinner plates the last plastic bag from pep home is this one so i got some fridge organizers i didn't know pep had this um, because I purchased fridge fridge organizers from a crazy store um, and they were a little bit pricey, not that expensive. And this one's at $34.99. And this you can put um, my baby, this I can basically use for my baby's juices, his yogurt, and my husband's cool drink, or even our um, sauces. I had to only get two of this for the time being because I do have quite a few of the organizers already in my fridge. And for my study area, I got this beautiful white bin. Um, and this one is a plastic, it's the plastic dustbin, obviously, and it went for $44.99. I do have one that I also use um, under my makeup desk. It's a black one. It was also $44.99, but it's not plastic like this one. However, I decided to get this. This looks super cute. I like the detailing around here. And yeah, I just decided to get this white bin. I also got this for my makeup things again i got a lot of white things this is actually a decorative planter but i decided i'm gonna use this for my makeup brushes once more because i'm gonna be buying i buy a lot of brushes and sponges and this one's went for nine rands 99 i got three of this i also got this cute ones for palettes or when i'm gonna be doing like a review like i mentioned i'll be doing a one branded makeup reviews um so i'm gonna place everything that i'll be using from that brand in this one container and just have everything with me and maybe just pack um, some powders or smaller palettes in here or whatever makeup products highlighters blushes in one of this so yeah I got this two and one went for 16 rands 99 each and they also have this really cute detailing around it I just love love this it looks almost similar to the one from the dustbin as well as from this holders i also just decided to get a sewing kit as well and then the last thing i got from pep home is this mat um it is a cotton runner mat um the size is 70 by 140 centimeters and this one was 179.99 got this in the color black just to break up the white a little bit so i'm going to place this underneath my study desk um yeah just for comfort um and stuff like that and yeah hopefully it's gonna fit i think so it's gonna fit it's gonna be fine i still do have some few clothing from choice clothing um it's just winter throwovers cardigans um like a winter top you know this type of top so I, I was thinking of buying something for my husband because he's been in bed um, for almost a month and um, I know he feels so hopeless because he can't help me, especially now that I'm pregnant and stuff like that. So I just wanted him to feel really happy and just surprise him with something. I still need to get like a gift box, but I think I'm just going to give him like that. <laughs> I, I won't have time to remember a gift bag or whatever. But anyways, I decided to purchase some stuff for my husband from Nike, stuff that he's been wanting for the longest time and my husband on the other hand he doesn't just go into any store and just buy he um, has a certain style that that is just so to say nowhere to be found <laughs> it's difficult to get his type of style and the clothing that he likes the majority of the times it's difficult to actually get his style or to give it a gift him with clothing or with shoes because getting him something is just so difficult um you literally need to like browse through stores and you can't really just surprise him i managed to somehow just ask him show me on nike i know he loves um nike and adidas stuff i was like show me something that you've been wanting or that you want to buy a little bit later on because my husband is not like myself he doesn't like spurring money on himself he he would prefer doing it for spending money on others except for himself so he always thinks of himself last and he has 
um, clothing that is years old <laughs> that is there before I was even there so he has a lot of old stuff and uh, but that are like sentimental to him and that are of good quality that still looks really really good because he takes care of his clothing and stuff like this and he doesn't wear them a lot he would literally be in shorts all day or in boxes all day and like a vest so yeah um i decided to like ask him um show me on your nike website on your nike website what type of um shoes you have in your chart just want to see what your style is i know his style <laughs> and he was like oh i love this do you know this do you guys remember my q a i mentioned my husband is trying to convince me to um go to boston not that i'm not convinced already i can go anytime just tell me when and where i'll be there <laughs> i'll be there um but i hope i'm in focus you guys he's a huge fan of basketball and he loves brooklyn the team brooklyn i think yeah i do apologize if i said the name wrong i don't know basketball honestly i'm a woman i don't <laughs> i care less about those things um so he told me about the dude and he told me all the nice things and how he can't wait to go i would actually love to buy him a ticket to go to brooklyn obviously i'll be joining with the kids but yeah just to see that excitement on his face making his day would make my day so i decided to go on to the nike website I took some of my money and I decided to buy, um, instead of buying more stuff like a carpet for the living room and some bar stools, which I was planning on doing, <laughs> I decided to get him um, two pairs of sneakers as well as two packs of three pairs of socks. Let me start with the socks. The first pair I actually opened because I bought unisex. <laughs> I'm also going to wear them. So this is the box that it came in. It says open for sport. I don't know what. <laughs> but yeah. That's the big box it came in. Is the lighting adjusted? Let me just see if the light is fine. Okay. That's the box it came in. Um, I have the email right here on my phone because I'm the one who placed all that so. The first pair I got was ankle socks. It's the Jordan Everyday Max ankle socks and it's three pairs. The quality is insane, you guys. Oh my God, it's so, so thick. I love, love, love the socks. Um, and I know he's gonna love them even more. Then the other pair of socks I got are the Jordan Everyday Max Unisex Crew Socks. And of course, I opened the pack because it's unisex, so I was trying out mine already. <laughs> so I'm not gonna say the prices because I'll just get heart attack. <laughs> And I think about the stress, I start feeling hot. <laughs> so yeah, I got those three pairs of socks. And then I got him, I think that's the name, I'm not sure. Jordan M2 Lunar Lounge Shoe. This shoe, I'm sure he's gonna love. The first box um, of sneakers. It says Jumpman on the box and designed for flight. This is the Jordan M2 Lunar Lounge Shoe. It says Vast Grey. Jim Red and Mahogany. I don't know, I think that's the shades that it comes in, but that's a beautiful shoe. I was so hesitant about the color and stuff like that, but now when I saw it in person, I was like, oh my God, this is super beautiful. This is how it looks like underneath. This is just stunning. this box oh my god look at that this is stunning this is stunning if i was into basketball i would have maybe been super obsessed this is stunning i can't imagine I'm gonna keep this he has to keep this <laughs> he has to keep this box this is the night zoom Kyrie 7 brooklyn beats um basketball shoe and it's the hip-hop edition and once more he is gonna love the color you guys oh my god I was like lime green what is that but he liked it and um i love it as well so this is like the olden days 
of with the Gazette on the back and then the Brooklyn Bridge over there. This is just stunning, you guys. But attention to detail. Let's inside says sure, the inside has Kyrie 7 with his signature on it. This is stunning. And I can't wait to see his expression. And yeah, you guys, that brings us to the end of this haul. I hope you all enjoyed it um, like I did. And I'm left with a lot of mess um, that needs to be cleaned up. But I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, kindly give it a huge thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, as well as hitting the notification bell right next to it. So you can always be notified once I do upload a new video. Also, do leave a comment down below and let me know which of the items you actually liked. If there's any and what you are more excited to see that I mentioned in this vlog that's coming up to let me know in the comment section i would love to interact with you guys i hope this was not way too long and that you really enjoyed it i'm super exhausted right now it's already night time but yeah that is it from me don't forget to share with your friends and your girlfriends so we can grow together thank you so much once more for watching do stay safe and i'll see you all in my next video bye